Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And we have pre-season group stage action coming right up for you. It is Manchester United and they face Al Itihad. Well, thanks, Derek. Now it's time to see whether this initial fitness training and development of tactics has been successful. Will there be any change of formations? These games are great to assess how these teams are evolving. McTominay, number 25, Jaden Sancho. Number 17, Fred. Number 18, Bruno Fernandes. And number 7, Cristiano Ronaldo. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Davy De Gea stands between the posts. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. This is what they'll be up against today. Well, the shape is the same, but they may play it in a slightly different way. And key to this game will be the fullbacks. Do they tuck in alongside their centre-halves or look to support their wingers? I hope it's the latter. And so the match is underway. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. He's lost it. Scott McTominay. Fred with it. Cristiano Ronaldo, one of the greatest players of the current era. And you'd have... Ronaldo! Oh, he's missed the chance to open the scoring. Well, that would have been a great start to the game. But that's a bad miss. Ronaldo, on to Bruno Fernandes, Ronaldo, and they know they need to stop it, a truly magnificent start, an early goal in the game, just what they were hoping to produce. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. El Ahmadi. Rodriguez. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Oh dear, oh dear. Opportunity squandered, Stuart. Well, what a chance that was for the equaliser. You don't get too many better than that.
Rafael Varane. Here's one Bissaka. Rashford. Sancho now. It's a fine United move in the making. But quick thinking defensively. El Ahmadi. Karim El Ahmadi with it. Here's Kamara. Osawi. Kamara. Not showing good patience. Crossing opportunity. Splendid tackle, and the outcome is a corner here. Who can they pick out? Well, he was closely marked, but the header well off target. Bruno Fernandes. Moving forward effectively. Well, the conclusion, he's missed the opportunity. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Well, we've almost reached the halfway mark here. Manchester United on top. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts so far. Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Encouraging stuff from United. But ultimately, up a cul-de-sac. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. So now, a corner. Trying to deliver it accurately. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Can he play it in? Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Juan Bisaka. Jaden Sancho. And in with a real chance. It's gone in. Well, they're really in the mood here. Can they be stopped? Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge. He keeps his balance and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. With that, the first half draws to a close.
as anticipated plenty of talking points so far and now the second half is underway Camera El Ahmadi on a struggle to get it away properly. Could reduce the deficit. Oh, tremendous goalkeeping! But now it grinds to a halt because the flag has been raised. United couldn't keep possession. Corner kick forthcoming. And United will switch things around personnel wise. And over comes the corner. Just the clearance that was called for. Well, that's a splendid piece of challenging. Well, there it is. United haven't had as much of the ball, but when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous. Particularly oh, wait a minute. They could well be in. Oh, a finish of real class. No wonder he's celebrating. Take a bow. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And the finish is so clever. He just gets his toe under the ball and dinks it over the keeper. That's a lovely goal. On they go again, and United beginning to run away with this. Ronaldo. Oh, a moment of pure class! Unbridled joy for him and the supporters! Well, here's the goal again, and it's all about the little Maradona turn to beat his man. Leaves him for dead. Ridiculous to be seeing that at this level. Well taken finish as well. It's a stunning goal. Here's a change for Manchester United. And we're underway again, and this game was finished as a contest a long time ago. Ahmed Egazi. Coming off the pitch, number 29, Aaron Wagner-Saka. Omar Hausawi. Number two, Victor Lindelof. And that's an important intervention. They've got it now, what can they do? A really effective shielding under... After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. is goalkeeping of the very highest order corner coming up
Trying to pick out a teammate. And he clears the danger. Into the final 20 minutes. United could get in behind the defence. Ronaldo. Oh, and it goes! Now he has his hat-trick. A special moment for him. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So two substitutes to come on in one go. if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome surely they now have been removed Rodriguez and a fine tackle space on the flank can he take advantage and that's how to deal with finesse well it's an easy save for the keeper it wasn't the best option that's for sure Well, as we approach full-time in this one, Stuart, no escaping the conclusion that United are bossing this. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Surely! Well, he was dreaming of scoring, but ruled offside. Well, it all happened very quickly, so I wouldn't criticise him too much. At least he was in there. For and United will switch things around personnel-wise. Maguire. Five minutes to go. Ronaldo. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Martial distributing shrewdly and tossing through. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. the final whistle a result to please Manchester United fans around the world what did you think of their performance as a whole well Derek what a good performance that was they did most things right and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge that was a really dominant display from them today